man, this is a pretty good video. And it was a pretty good Comic-Con. Be pretty silly if it happened again. That's not what we're doing. That's, that's not. I don't think so, no. No, that's not. We're just, we're watching this just to enjoy it. Yeah, well, we're just watching it to enjoy it. What is it, like August 17th? Yeah, it's not like it's going to be tomorrow as if I like snap my fingers and just, we're there. Yeah, and obviously not. No. No. Never. Never going to do that. Well, yeah, so uh, just a casual day on August 17th at night. We're just ended up watching this and, you know, we're planning a few things. We're just planning out like uh, the hotel. You know, we're getting started on that. We're co-planning. We're co-planning the uh, the parking and the uh, and the groceries too. You no, know, it's uh, it's pretty wild. And I think we might have an additional person join this year, possibly. Yeah, we might we might have six. I mean, we, I mean, Joe's right. Joe's right there. He can hear us. Oh, seven? Uh, so we we might have seven? total of seven, dude. We're the Justice League. Sick. Nice. Can I be Ant Man? Check it out, guys. It's him. He's real. No, I don't want to be real. You are real. <laughs> You're real on November uh, 25th. <laughs> Does that mean I have to pay taxes? Yes, especially at uh, 8, 20, something or other, I can't tell. Oh shoot, man! This is this is sort of like a companion piece because uh, me and Ricky did this sort of thing on uh, like mid August when we were first planning for LA stuff, which is in like less than a week. Yeah, yeah, it like, is less than a week. It's about five days from now that at least we get together. Is this this is part of the vlog? This would be part of it. Yeah, yeah. I know you need to look a little more presentable. <clears throat> Wish I had my hat on. Is it part of the blog? Is it? Oh? 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 oh. oh. I already hit the oh. stop on mine. Oh. Uh, hey guys, look, it's a setup that we have for the den because the garage is uh, kind of cold right now. But yeah, so yeah next time we do a video it's gonna be it's gonna be thursday it's gonna be thursday afternoon yeah we're gonna be waiting for... hey since this is part of the offline no it's not yeah. i was gonna date and time it but that's i already did it. yeah oh you're right beginning. that's right you're good you're yeah good. so you don't have to worry about that yeah so yeah next time you see us it'll be like thursday afternoon and hopefully the four of us have gotten together and are waiting for the other two don't forget to uh love each other uh stop hate uh no war uh make love but not well do what you want um and this game scooby-doo night of a hundred frights unrelated to la comic-con but so far uh i miss obi-wan well now you're just getting political i so. miss obi-wan hello buddy it's not too long after I just saw you, or after you saw me. No, oh, yeah. But, uh, we're, uh, next time we're gonna see each other, we're gonna be going to Le Kumakun. We are, yeah. Le Kumakon. Yeah. Le Kumakon. Yeah. Don't let the cameras show it, because it's just like my family calendar. Yeah. Uh, they won't see it at all. Nope, not at all. They're seeing us right now, though. <laughs> exactly. As you can see here, the uh -huh. art that was for a second specifically blocked by the phone. Uh-huh. Uh, yeah, there, hopefully, by the time you and Donovan get around, I will have gotten AJ already. Mm-hmm. So we just kind of make sure not to buy anything 
here, 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 or here. <laughs> or the morning of here. <laughs> After, I am gonna. After that, it's it's kind of game on. I'm, I am uh, gonna have to buy food to live, though. True, true. But other than that, you know, he doesn't know I already bought some stuff. <laughs> uh, yeah. Actually, Donovan and I are preparing to play a little bit of Magic: The Gathering. There, we're also gonna be having a D and D session there. We are. Yeah. Uh, which would be cool. Uh, our boy, Ricky the Ricklick, uh, he's gonna be the DM. That's gonna be a fun one, so we can finally play together again. Oh yeah, <laughs> I was like. Wait a minute, have we never played? No, we no, have. Because we have. Don- Donovan stuff. Donovan stuff. Whoop. So, yeah. Yeah, that is pretty cool. That is pretty solid. So. Our hotel may look like this. Wow. This might be us you're looking at. Here, let me. Wow. That might be us in there. That might me. be us. Wow. You and me. See, look. That's you. Uh huh. That's AJ. Uh huh. That's me. I'm like, guys, get in. It's like 48 degrees out. <laughs> You're present. No, man. We. The tree in there? Mm hmm. That's Ricky. Ricky's a tree? Yep. Okay. Uh, there's a ghost in here. That's Donovan. Uh huh. That's true. Yep. And then Ricky's friend, who, yeah. whom we haven't met yet. Uh, he would be. Is there anybody, like, inside? Yeah, there's a person right there and a person right there. There's two people. Okay, well, then Harder there you go. Harder for the camera then to that's see. Just, then, there you go. There you can see them now. that's just Donovan and, uh, that's Donovan and Harry. It's Donovan and Harry. Yep. Uh, Joe is in here. <laughs> because Joe, we might not see yeah. Joe this year, guys. Unfortunately, but we might not see him. Possibly. Possibly. Any last words? Uh, jeez, well, uh, well, when I die, I would like... Oh, no, actually, you know what? Can you perform a magic trick for me? Clap sure. your clap your hands, and then when you clap your hands, it's gonna be Thursday. Are you sure I got it? Yeah, just just try it. All right. Let's see. I think. Wink. Do a double blank. Close your eyes and jump. What the? What the heck? Hey guys, what day is it? It's Thursday. <gasps> it worked. But it's like it's like the 31st. Poggers. Look at that. Look how pretty that is. Now look how pretty. Fuck. Fuck. This is. Not very. Not here? Okay. Here? But, yeah, yeah. But no, wait, hold on. But actually, yay! Hey. Um, we have to wait hey. for Donovan, so we're getting some grub. But everyone else ate, right? Hey. Hey. Okay, copyright. It is 6.19 now. Uh, Donovan has just finally gotten here. Mm -hmm. Now, we thought we would leave a little little earlier, but, you know, this has been a nice and exciting uh, first day. I think every year we've left later than we were originally planned. Yep. So this is on track. Yeah, next year we're going to be leaving at, like, midnight. (laughs) On Wednesday. (laughs) Yeah. (laughs) No, next week we're going to be leaving, like, after the Comic-Con. Yep. We're going to miss it entirely. Pretty much. No, that's, like, 2030. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now we get on the road. I don't think you can see him, but that's AJ there. That's Austin O'Rourke. Oh, my ah, my eyes. Blind. There he is. Die in three, two, one. Oh no! He has that power. You know he has that power. It's alright. No one has the power. They all have the power. I'm watching. He does, but I know he's recording, so he's not using that power. I can multitask. <laughs> Thank you.
Ah. Just disappeared with very eyes. <laughs> uh whenever I sit down. I can feel the left cheek. I can feel the cheek. AJ, where's your right cheek? Like when you're like as when, while you're in line or no, when you're when you're in but you're actually on it. Okay. Yeah, and he's like, yeah. All right, get hello, ready. hello, please, yeah, keep, please keep your hands on feet and legs inside the cart at all times. I don't know why he's Indian. Uh, <laughs> yeah. If I'm gonna keep it here for a few days, I gotta keep doing it. Yeah. We're on our way up. We're on our way up. We are. We're on our way up. We're on our way up. Up, up, up. We're on our way. We got a nice upgrade to the room because they were very cool. And wow, look at all this. That's cool. Dude, look at this. Bro, okay, so... This is really nice. And they're all like... Let me explain how well that here. went. Because $50 a night for an in upgrade s- is hella good. Yeah, that's yeah. So wait, in sense, I thought it was 75 No, I oh. just said that's good. Sure. fun. So, so we spent a grand per se for five nights on this thing. That's like $200 a night. That's so good. No, it, it really is. Because like this, this room, inside of LA? Yeah. Like, this room, is uh, when I was checking for it, was going to cost like 1400 So a night? No, no, for the five days. For the five days, and now we got it for one day. Yeah. That's so we so saved like $100 a night for Huge. Yeah. That's pretty huge. And you know what else is huge? Mm-hmm. My love for you guys. Yay! Yay! I just missed it. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, now I got to go shopping with you guys tomorrow. I missed it. Dude, you can shower and get like a view. Is it we might need to Whoa. see if we can get more towels. That's actually. nice. Yeah. Uh, but this is the room. So last time I was in a hotel that was like this, this was the TV that I was able to hook my switch into. Nice. The other one was harder, but we can all fit here technically. Second. Oh, we have a nice view. Nice view. Of rampant uh, Seventh Street. I think, I don't know if we can see the car here. We should be able to, right? Yeah, I think, uh, I don't know if you can see, but I think right there, oh, here, right there, I think is Ricky's car. Kind of a nice open space with very dark lighting. This is where, this is the party room. This is the adults room. Sure. Dude, look how fancy the door is. The door's very That's fancy. Fancy. Can you see my silhouette through this? Of course. When I was in this hotel, yeah. uh, my one friends, light works. Uh, I think nice to. I was with Well, he went to bed. Oh, that's right. And real quick, guys, and it was uh, are any of these lights working like, no. out there? No, they don't do anything. Alrighty then, so we just have that one light. Uh, there is a thermostat in here, the giant machine. It's actually not bad. Theoretically, yeah. Well, it's just like claustrophobia. Yeah. Yeah. Nope. Yeah. What? Look. The twin air mattress? This is where Austin and Donovan are gonna sleep. That's where Harry's gonna be. And one can assume that's where Age is. All right, that's that's where Austin and Donovan are going to just lie down and think about death. Everyone thank Harry. Thank you, Harry. Hey, he's, he's coming. It's nice. As you can see, the palette, the color palette here is a Hollywood Mexican restaurant. 
and with a slight Wait, aspect of Burger King. Yeah. What's up, gang? Everyone else is gone. It's just me in here. It's just you and me. So listen, before we get, I keep wanting to look over here because that's where I am. Before we get to the con, let me show you what we brought, what I brought at least, uh, well, to enjoy my stay. Cool, look at this kitchen, but you have already seen the place. I got a cat thing. I actually got this uh, last year. There, I got this one for me and then a green one for my friend Jimmy. Um, at PAX this year, my friend Jimmy bought me cat dye. I paused for a second because I thought there was nothing in here. Uh, but there, it's all, it's all there. Look, they got little, uh, they got little cat things on them. This is, oh, there we go. And that's like the highest number of values. So that's a natural 20. Sorry, death perception is really weird because I'm like looking through the camera instead of like doing that and just looking at it, which I'm doing now. So here we got, Owen bought me this, uh, I think for my birthday or for Christmas one year, uh, but it's a critical roll uh, thing, so I got a natural 20 on here. I actually rolled this at a Pathfinder 2 session recently, uh, doing like the beginner box, and I got a crit on uh, someone, uh, one of my players. So yeah. No, 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 no. All right, and then the other stuff I brought. So Donnie and I, well before that, AJ and I are going to try, I want to learn the Digimon card game. If we don't get to this, that's fine. But if we do, that's cool. These are still sealed. I haven't opened them yet. I uh, should probably take the tape off. Uh, this is Donovan Steam Deck. Mine's right there. Uh, these are sleeves. These are my sleeves. These are sleeves I bought for Donnie. And uh, Donovan brought, uh, he bought the fourth Doctor commander deck for magic and i wanted been wanting to learn magic so i was like oh this is going to be fun so i got that and then that's commander format for the year but this is the start a starter kit so we can uh play together i want to convince him for me to have this one and him to take the other one because i'm already the bad guys for doctor who i want to be the good guys for lord of the rings and i finally saw lord of the rings this year um yeah so that has davros and missy on it missy's from season eight yeah season eight well, she's also in 9 or 10. I don't know. I'm, I'm on a rewatch. Well, actually, I'm done with my rewatch. I'm on a currently, like, on Capaldi's second season, so I still need to watch that. But anyways, you don't care. So, I got this. I was with the boys a Sunday ago, and I got that at Target. I also got... Uh, I brought Switch stuff. This. Myrtle! 100 elementary to impossible mystery to solve using logic, skill, and the power of deduction. So that'll be fun, like, between panels or something. Then I have a Pro Controller in there. My laptop, my Steam Deck was in there. Uh, but then this stuff... So I got fooled at Target. I thought this was just Chainsaw Man number one. Uh, but it's a novel. Was there actually a picture in there? Eh. Come. Okay. Uh, but I was, saw these, and I was like, that's... Oh, is that Target? And I was like, that's funny. Spider-Man and Superman manga. And I was like, might as well read them while I'm at Comic-Con. Uh, that's my three-day pass. That's my hat. That's my water bottle. And there's a switch in there. That's it. Oh, they're getting, uh, they're getting food. And they're bringing me back a Pepsi. And we're going to play D&D tonight. So I need to look at some magic items to pick up. So that's what I'm gonna do. Heading back to find Austin, where I'm sure he's doing school stuff and not being a dweeb. Yes. I'm already in it. That, no, it, it doesn't count because it's, it's the same thing like... Yeah. like
Plus zero? Yeah. Well, I'm not a druid. I had 26. Oh, okay. They get like three rolls. I don't know. Hold on one second. All this time. If I, never mind. Mm -hmm. I'm dumb. I'm just going on how, how the number counts. Let me do this. What you, you, the barrel you found uh -huh. was full, which made it six. Six times. So we put in the barrel. So yeah, now we need you see. two bones. Okay. Now we just need to look for two bones. Oh, They're two pounds each. All right. All right. I did really bad again. <laughs> it seems that every time you pick up these bones now, they're withering away. Oh, Let's be careful on having shit. you grab these bones. Uh, 15. 15, you're able to find one. All right. Just one or gold? Just one. one. I'm going to throw it on there. Are there two more pieces of clothing? No, there's no more clothing yet. There's no more clothing amongst the bones. We need no, two more pounds. But what, a minute? Take off your clothes. Ah! Uh, <laughs> are you naked? I need my shit. You All got right. one too. I do my shirt too. You said you were naked as you're getting a skit, sir. That was a joke. I actually described myself in robes. Yeah, he said he was wearing like right. a militaristic. All right, I give it to you. Yeah, 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 yeah. I give it to you. Put your the stone open. then suddenly sinks in. Stone rotates halfway. Almost like a Rubik's Cube half. And then it rotates again the opposite way. It opens. And there's this floating within it. Mind. The topographical map of Wisconsin. Mind of yours. Maybe. Begins to disassemble itself the center, moving and flowing outwards, revealing this hollow, empty room with an altar in the middle, and two figures slowly inspecting it. Now before we continue there, I will let poor old Harry now <laughs> Harry, your character- But first I'd like to- <laughs> <laughs> Our room's open. Frankie just went, no, that would be your mother. <laughs> oh, wait, what the 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 <laughs> oh, just a little more. Oh. Ah. Oh, wait, I'm not here. <laughs> We're hurriedly putting clothes on top of the lock. <laughs> so Austin, Sarah, why are they shirt this? So Austin and Donovan are in our in the room now? Well yeah, we see you. currently but we're currently freeze framed. Uh, okay. So that these guys can Yeah, Mickey cast a stop gun. I don't I don't this one. He has some pogger ass though. How are we doing this? And like we can play this and you don't even get to use them. Where is Zeta Flare in my regular gameplay? Um, oh, he yeah, staging this. displays your beast. As this is happening with yeah, this his is tail, pure staging. This, the tail this is pure staging. in one place, but the animal itself is moving, almost as if it's doing this kind of a thing. So as it moves, it then backs up this way. In Farts which, in his face. Uh, in which then uh, jumps over and lands in between the two. Oh mercy. Um, that's a 
so I'm going to do the display soon. Next is AJ Harry and that's it. I was talking with me because it's my character's name in my other campaign, and we usually call each other my character's name. So he's like, AJ, and I'm like, yeah. I mean, I would have my shades on and be like, all right, let's go. <laughs> Uh, I use Toll the Dead on this Displacer Beast. Make a Wisdom Saving Throw. Oh, that's smart. What does Toll the Dead do? Uh, if you fail the save, you take damage. If you succeed, you take no damage. What do I have to beat? Um, Third page. I'm going to guess this team. How's my mulligan going? Okay. Uh, bonus action. We shall 14. Fourteen. Fourteen? Yeah, he fails. Nice. Nice. So roll damage. Do you take damage already? Oh, okay. Did you miss that part? That's what the dead does. Yeah, I mean, Wait. Well, yeah. Is he hurt? You know? He has. He has. He has some damage. Okay, on. you can upgrade it. Wait. All right. Yeah. How? Well, yeah, earthquake. Oh, right. So he takes more damage. Jeez. Okay, so that's nine, and. You have things right here for it's in a one. So that's ten damage. Okay. Takes ten damage now. Necrotic damage. Um uh, as a bonus action. Oh, I don't know. So you move as a in space? Bonus action? Can I move in a bonus action? You can you can no. move. No. You, but you can move. Yeah, you can move. You have a movement action. Yeah. You have 30 feet of movement. Okay. And as you move... Where are you going? <laughs> yep. But you are leaving his sp range, so he gets an attack of opportunity. Okay, then I'll just... Stay. And it would be an action to hide, since you're not a rogue. Alright. That's so it. Like cunning action gives you... Okay, so do you yeah, cunning you action is what No, okay. Okay. I'm staying, just damage. Harry's next, uh, Austin. There's okay. literally four people who DM'd at this table. <laughs> uh, five, actually. Five? Harry's DM'd as well? Yeah. Quite a bit. When are you gonna do it? I would love for you to DM like 2E, because you've played 2E. Um, do I see any like... Yeah. It's too much work on the mic, though. Right You'd have to be really patient with us to learning 2E. I can't wait to learn that. <laughs> um, I'm gonna have the rats run around and hide. One goes in the chest. Thank you. Thank you. About 148 now. You like that, uh, and we're not quite done yet, enough. but we'll it get to it later. So yep. They're not paying attention. Live and learn. And they've added two hours. <laughs> That's not how you solve the puzzle. I literally, the beginner. <laughs> the answer's box, right there. The beginner box for Pathfinder 2 e I think it's supposed <laughs> to be like a, maybe a two, three session thing. Six. It is about 9 a.m. now. The second day has begun. Life's pretty crazy, guys. Check out that tall tower. Like that, yeah, it's getting some work done on it. Most buildings in LA look like they're getting some work done. Something's going on down there. Anyway, everybody else is asleep right now. Oh, except for me and Ricky. Uh, we are going to go over to Target, possibly to get some uh, get some breakfast stuff together, or you know, just more stuff you know because we also have to move the car just because of the parking structure and everything so yeah uh, we're just gonna be really quiet getting out and if we wake up anybody i'll let you know but hey that's pretty cool <laughs> See the car just from right there. Where the blooming is it? Right there. You see on the wall it says PM? No, I've seen it. 
we look just the right there. That big old red thing, that's our car. Oh yeah, yeah, I'll see the big old red thing. Okay, so that, I believe that's our car. I wonder, hold on, wait, 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 wait. zoom in again. Oh, there we go. I wonder if I can look at it from here. I'm zooming. Let's see. No, I don't see it. I think it might be too big for. Yeah. Or it's just not your car. No, it's a woman. Let me car be. Let me car be up in heaven. In car heaven. Car heaven? Yeah, it's down there. There's better parking. I get that. But who's going to pay for the fares for the car that was here? Well, I'll parked there. I'll see. Wait, get back here. Okay, then. Oh, okay. Prices. So good. I could be an amateur wrestler. I'm Spider Man. I'm Spider Man. Three minutes in the ring. I'm Spider Man. He wants a girl. Has to possibility. Where did he go? Where did he go? They might be, yeah. Uh, they're just random ideas, you know. Needs a simple. Probably a centipede or something else. He did it, he did it, he's making the spider, he's making the man, he's making a spider man with girls in the background, colored blue for me and you. He's gonna be in a PlayStation 2 game with pizza. Bless you, bless you. Who's seen the most players in the room naked? Oh, I haven't seen any of you guys naked. Nor have I. No, I don't think any of us have seen Okay, hold on. So let's, let's modify it then. Semi-naked in the form of infinity rooms, mm. such as plays. Mm. Ooh, I think it's a tie. I think. Oh, wait. I think Ricky just outed himself because he knows everybody. I don't, I don't, I don't, I've never seen well, No. Well, he looked at me when I was a kid. Well, Ricky said. He looked at me when I was a kid. The reason why I'm choosing Donovan is Donovan's been in a show with Owen, Ricky, and I, but we all can't say that about each other. But you've been in a show with me. You've been in a show with Owen. You've been in a show with Donovan. How are you going to show with Ricky? Yes. Thank you. Yeah. All right. All right. For that kind of view, I'll take the card. <laughs> all right. Just for like parts. anywhere except for the very back here, because this is, that's where I put the table. Just all these? Yeah. Literally just not the very last part, because that's where I put the first one. Who will your great grandchildren read about in school? I'm stuck between these two. I honestly think it would be Owen. Wow, for honor. How about your grandchildren? Oh. So who would your kids know the most? Oh, shit. Read about. Who will my kids know about the yeah, most? Oh. Kids, between these two. I think it would be Owen. It is hard. Because, here's my logic. 
Say Mama does get into voice acting, and there's all these cartoons. Uh -huh. Can you remember cartoons? That's what but they don't about. read about them, they it's, watch them. It's true, but I feel like he'd be a greater actor with a wider variety than Owen just with kids. <laughs> that's how to make that sound like a diss. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like he's he kid kids. He'd have Owen a chip on, on his shirt. That's true. He dressed, dress he came as a kid. Don't disrespect on Bucky's name. He's a son That's just normal. That's just normal Owen, though. My vote is a vote. What are you voting for, AJ? I changed from Donovan to Owen. Sorry. I'm fine with it. You don't want to have to play this game. No, I know. Run near you. Just do, you can also do like um, top down, so that's easier to. No, not sideways, but like up. Yeah, side, but like, yeah, physically up. Yeah. Are we in it? Oh, hell yeah. And then kind of point it down towards the cup so you can see yours when it comes in. Like, <clears throat> Kids, do not try this at home. Are we going to use our intro as the, yes. as the thing? Yeah. All right, guys. Three, two, one. Welcome, Welcome to Downtown Boomtown. Boom 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 population us. us. Ah, it's good stuff. <laughs> it's like eating right there. So we're leaving to go to, to go get some lunch right now. We're closing up shop. That's Ricky. Did you say you gotta take a dump? No. <laughs> no. Come here. Yeah, we went lost right here there before. The first year when we were buying you guys drinks at Ralph's, we walked this way. Shouldn't have. Should have gone that way. Look, and there's the message. Yeah. You are a goddess living in the city. It gets full after a good meal. What's he doing? He changes his numbers. He's no longer 666 because he's not that hungry because he just ate 888. Yeah. That's a topical joke. A topical joke. A topical joke by Austin. A topical joke. A topical joke. A topical joke by Austin. We're going to fictions, yay! It's the Ritz Carlton. Third year in a row I passed that boy. Third year in a row, I passed the skate. I want you to go in. I want you to go in the hole. Find the right spot. Tina, eat hole. the food. Eat the food. What is that from? The boy in Dynamite. Well, it's in the hole, but it's not its not sliding in that far. Maybe it's how I'm putting it in? Maybe if I open it up more. You're wondering why I want to put this back in? That's what I just don't want to leave it on the table. It feels weird. It's like I don't like putting open silverware just like on the table. I'm like, eh, hey, I want to put it on the plate, you know? Be good evening. That scared the shit out of me. That was in my peripheral vision. Or it wasn't until I was like right here. And I was like, holy shit. There's a fucking camera pointed at me. I got the gumbo. It's pretty good. Mm -hmm. I think I got the sandwich last time. Look here, Sin, you've paid your tithe. You've, uh, you've taken your blood of Christ. No, what's it called? Uh, that the Catholic Church did? Indulgence? Repentance. No. The thing you would pay for. Oh. An indulgence, yeah? No. You pay for it. Like a tie? 
No, you paid for it so your dead your dead family would go to heaven. It was bullshit. Oh, it's called an indulgence. It's called a bribe. Well, uh, yeah, it's a type of bribe. <laughs> If I make a generous donation of this amount into the church, does that mean my family's gonna be okay? The funny part is, is how would why would you believe that they even have a say? Like who you're giving the money to? I should also say I am wearing new shoes. New wear shoes, I should say. So if it if it does end up raining at some point out of nowhere, I will not slip. I will not fall. I will not tremble. Is that a ball? No, oh, wait, that's a building. Third year in a row. Cthulhu Khan. The game is on. Bow out of respect. This reporting in, Owen and Ricky are gonna hit the blicky while they race and trace around the track. And that's a fact. I was looking at Harry while I was reciting that. Anyways, let's see how our boys do. Remember guys, drifting gives you a boost. Pick up the mushrooms, you'll go faster. If you get a star, you can completely obliterate the other person. If Ricky is having trouble getting into that, imagine how much trouble I would have. I guess they're explaining. I have no colorful commentary to give while I'm waiting. So instead we're just gonna, oh, oh. Beep, beep, beep. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Oh, oh. Ricky, you suck. Oh, oh, and you suck. Oh, he got a lead. Oh, but he's got the better turn. Oh, it's a pretty good turn. 
And next up, we got the clear. We got the clear on the pad. Oh, looks like, looks like, all right. We slow down for the turn and we're going in and we're not going to hit anything and we didn't. Hey, we're going for round two and now we got Ricky. You're still sucking, Ricky. Get in the game, Ricky. Come on, man. He's too far behind. Honestly, it's, he should give up at this point. Just walk home, buddy. Look how far ahead Owen is. Unless Owen gets in a crash. Is he going to get into a crash around the corner? He does not get into a crash around the corner. He's going. He's going. He's going. He's going. He's going. He's going. And Ricky is catching up a little bit by bit. And then we got one more lap. I think if it's out of three, I have no idea how this works. Dun, 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 dun. All right. Come on. No. Why did you stop? All right. Owen, honestly, you could smoke him. You can finish your next lap by the time he's done with this one. I'm trying to encourage him with my negativity. Oh, looks like Ricky's just going to have to accept being second place as Owen comes in for the win. Oh, he's waiting. What's this? A challenge? Oh, just to rub the salt in the wound. This round goes to Owen Townsend. Oh. Owen, I guess, literally doing a victory lap. Unnecessary, but it was fun. Look at him styling. This has been Segway. You can find them on social media platforms such as Instagram. And part. I've been your commentator, Austin from Moontown. Let's go. Welcome back to round two. It looks like we're gonna have, uh, ooh. I didn't want to crash. AJ the and the red and Donovan in the yellow. Uh, Ooh, and in the back, we have someone giving a list of uh, excuses. I hear excuses coming from this man. Yeah, I started learning how to drift. That's, that like is pretty good. Yeah. Although Owen made some pretty clutch turns. Owen, how did you feel about those turns? Yeah, I didn't want to crash into Owen either. If I wanted to be aggressive, All right. I could have cut him off. All right, we have the two. We have Donovan in the back, also known as Donnie Boy. Also, Donnie. AJ. Now, Austin, awesome. if you were a betting man, what guy would you put? Oh, oh it looks like, is this unsportsmanship? Did he start before? Oh, but Donovan takes it! Looks like the, you know what? Look, it's neck and neck. Oh, he's going ahead. How good is the turn? That was trash. Garbage. You're horrible. Making them do more work on the track. But they feel bad. They're going ahead. But it looks like AJ doesn't have the skills to really pull ahead. And looks like Donovan's just going to be consistent. I think Donovan's going to the need for speed. And we're on round two right now. Looks like AJ's pulling up behind. Not too bad. I really hope they don't hit the nice people that are running it. And it looks like they're not cool. And if you look over there, you'll see someone with a better camera probably doing better shots than what I'm doing. But hey, Donovan's coming around. And look, what goes around does come back around. He's back for the final lap. And looks like we have AJ finally coming in. But is he going to pull it up? He definitely went there. But as we segue into this last lap, it looks like Donovan's probably going to pull out the champ. And it's going to be two for the yellow uh, cart. And it just looks like they're just going to win. He's going to come around. He's going to do it. Three, two, one. Woo! Well, now we know both Ricky and AJ have to walk home. No, like, like home home. We're gonna beat you up, take the keys, and leave you and AJ behind. You have to catch me first. Well, luckily behind me, I have some vehicles that might be able to help. Yeah, don't worry. I'm the champion. I, I know I can outrun. <laughs> Not it. sponsored by Segway. Hey guys. Uh, off. Off line. Ish. Ish. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I gotta adjust the mic here. I also have to adjust the mic. Oh, well, that's nice that we're in the same boat here. Adjusting the mics. Hey, uh, yeah, just to get us all in the same boat. Cool. Here we go. Uh, the reason that you are hearing this instead of like, hey, what happened to the video? Yeah. So, what it is. Mm -hmm. Tell him, honey. Do, 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 da, do. I had my stuff in the iCloud photos. Do, da, do. And then I brought them onto my drive, you see. Do, da, do. And then I figured, well, it's on my drive now, so I can just delete it. Do, da, do. From my iCloud photos permanently. Da, 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 do. And then, of course, suddenly there was this thing. Da, do, and the, 
This is, it's hard to do both of these yeah, <laughs> tempos at the same you're time. Doing. Yeah. Uh, I'll just give you. I'll listen. I'll just give you some background music. Sure. So, anyways, this was kind of switching genres. Uh, I put it all on the drive, and suddenly, a couple days later, uh, maybe like a week later, actually, I was getting ready to start working on the video. And I was putting in all of this stuff, you know, I didn't want to put too much footage into iMovie or else then they would just like crack under the pressure of like three hours of stuff, counting me and Austin's stuff. So uh, the computer was like, hey, uh, you know, you haven't done a backup in a while. You want to do that? And I was like, heck yeah, because I was able to do that with my old hard drive. But it's like a newer one I got this Christmas. So... Uh, I do the backup, everything's going nicely, except for some reason I can't open up things in my hard drive now. Oh no! Because I guess the backup switched over, like, what the hard drive could do, and it was like, oh yeah, it's just, the hard drive's just view only, exactly how you want, you wanted it. I said, no, I, that's not at all what I want, I want to just get my stuff. And he's like, and it's like, nope, it's just the backup here, nothing else, alright, bye, you can only view it. So, after a, a frustrating weekend of me and my dad looking through every option we could. Every option. And then a week later, like, looking at more options to see if there was anything we missed. Uh, there was no plausible and or legal way that we could get uh, the L.A. footage, or at least my footage, back you, from the hard drive. Did you find an illegal way? I'm sure I just it was like that you said that. I'm sure it was there somewhere. <laughs> I found no legal way, <laughs> but I was tempted by this one website that said I could get you all videos. But the for black free. market said that I could. <laughs> but the deep net told but yeah, me we I tried, could dig deeper. We looked into like six different tabs at one day that like all led to these different things. I tried resetting my iPhone to see if I could get a backup of the previous time when I had those videos on my iPhone so I can get them from the cloud. But that didn't work. We tried this thing to like scrub through the hard drive that cost like 20 bucks, but it did nothing. So we tried to get a refund for it and it took a while, but they said uh, no, because I guess that's not how their particular thing works. It's a long winded way of saying uh, me, Owen Townsend, I done goofed up and uh, any f footage of LA Comic Con from my perspective that you have not already seen is gone. Yeah. Except for maybe one or two videos you'll see later on. But everything else is gone. So here we are. So the lesson of the day is if you're importing or if you're exporting a bunch of videos or a bunch of pictures anywhere, make sure you have them in one other place. It could be in the Google Drive. Uh, I have a Microsoft OneDrive that I totally could have used. Uh, you could keep them on your photos like while you're still editing them like on the off chancy but i just i just felt confident that you know my sick new hard drive that's like five terabytes could do the job and technically it could it's just a backup it that messed up everything now this is not at all without a forlong hope all of austin's stuff is still available mm -hmm. uh there are like one or two other videos of mine and then also there's the greatest hard drive of all memory I thought you were gonna say god's mind and then we end up somehow turning this podcast into a journey through space and time to outside the physical barrier where we see you mean to the dimension of, of hysteria. hysteria uh we'll talk about uh, uh scooby-doo and kiss in an upcoming scooby-doo episode <laughs> so maybe yeah. maybe uh, but yeah, so we're just kind of doing this ramshackle way of, you know, we're we have a we have a computer up right now, kind of just scrolling through the the videos that you will see, and we're just giving you like a brief explanation. So last we left off, our intrepid heroes were on the go karts, and that was pretty cool. That was cool. Yeah, that was a fun time. And before that, we had actually just eaten at yeah uh, we fixins. we had fixins. Yeah, they saw that. So. uh what happened after that? After that, I saw someone who was cosplaying as Grahati in Final Fantasy XIV, and I thought that was cool. And then we spent the majority, we felt like maybe two hours, um, in like the anime gaming section. Uh, and then there was the robot fight that you saw that I missed. Yes. So at one of the 
uh, with like all the booths and stuff that had a lot of weird stuff going on in there in that in that whole hall. But a cool thing was, I guess these guys from New Zealand came over and they were setting up these robot fights. It was like these tiny little like like they looked you know like they looked like Mad Max Fury Road style Roombas mm-hmm. that like you could pilot and. You know, they had different colors on them. They're in this cage with, like, plexiglass all over so the shards of metal wouldn't shoot into people's faces. Jeez. And it was pretty sick that, like... Because each of them had... Each of these little robot dudes had, like, bumpers or, like, little blades. And the goal was to hit as much of the colored armor off of anybody else as you could before time ran out. So... That was some pretty sick stuff. Uh, AJ and Donovan were a part of that. And uh, yeah, they were able to. Uh, AJ was able to win. AJ won. So that means AJ won the sick robot fight. So that means overall, you beat Ricky in kart racing. Donovan beat AJ in kart racing, but AJ beat Donovan in robots. Yep. <laughs> if me and Ricky had fought in the robot fighting, uh, I would have still won. Yeah. Yeah. And Ricky can't prove wrong. No. Nope. What he said wrong. No, nope, it's Schroding Schrodinger's robot fight. <laughs> Schrodinger's robot fight. <laughs> yeah. But it was a pretty chill first day. We got mm-hmm. to explore that. I think we w- went around a little. Did you turn little... the volume on that off? Yeah, I did. Yeah, so that it wouldn't like oh, interfere okay, cool. with this. Yeah, we went around a little bit. Uh, we got these sick uh, game grump crowns. Game grump crowns, as you'll as you're about to Bird see. Game grumps crowns. Yeah, as I you're about to see, nine. and a lot of our, a lot of time now just ended up being, uh, us kind of chilling out. Waiting for other folks to do their shopping. Yeah, I uh, think... You'll see an, a familiar friend in a second. True. Uh, you'll also see, as we scroll through here, uh, a bunch of cool stuff that these guys were able to get. I myself did not... I don't think I bought anything this day. Because mm-hmm. I was still, like, you know, looking around, browsing That's stuff. I did get a sick, uh, like, a beer cooler from the... Uh, I think it's from the Coast Guard. That's what that is? Yeah. I like, feel like I never noticed that day of... Well, yeah, that's not a thing I'd show off like, yo, guys, check it out. I think I just got, like, a free one. Dope. So that was cool. Yeah, I think today, that part of the con, there was, I don't even think, I don't even have that much footage looking what I got from there because that's the last thing I have up from the con that day. And yeah. then the next is, like, yeah, that target at, later on. Yeah, after that, uh, we went over to some stairs. Ricky took control. He yeah. grabbed us and he dominated our minds. That's true. And he said, "We're going this way." And I said, "No, okay. gay." A reflection of the D and D game that we played. Pretty much. Uh, yeah. And then we kind of stocked up on these nice uh, snacks that you will see in a second. While Harry was uh, looking around trying to find a nice jacket for himself. Is there anything you can remember from after this that you recorded on December first? Uh, I can. Friday. I can. Yeah. Uh, after this, we did more. Uh, we went back to the D&D session mm-hmm. because we had only gotten like <laughs> halfway done. Yeah, halfway done. Goofballs. But it was pretty sick. Uh, we could talk a little bit. Uh, my guy was a heron gone, so he's like a rabbit guy. Got and then had character sheets. Yeah. My guy was named Jasper Jr. Uh, he had a Junior. he had sort of a New Zealand accent. Is he a bunny guy? Yeah, he's a bunny guy. And uh, he has a Hexblade Warlock, level mm. 5. Uh, he had this cool Dragon Slayer Rapier. Uh, he actually was a pretty terrible-looking nasty dude who got, like, experimented on. Mm. But, you know, his disguised self let him look just like a nice fluffy dude who was nice and innocent. Yes. Uh, then your guy, My if you can go a little was, bit into him. He was, his name was Ken Yosh, or Yosh. I don't remember how I wanted it. Um... I think I did Ken because... Kennergy? No. Uh, I mean, I like that, but... I forgot. Uh, I played as a Ronin uh, subclass of Samurai, which is not from the regular D&D stuff. It's from a Final Fantasy XIV 5e fan companion guide. Um, my... Let's see. I had pretty good stuff. I had a Vicious Katana, which was a plus 7 to hit. And then, like, it did plus 12 damage, just because that's the whole thing that it was about. If I hit you, I hit you hard. Because my character didn't have much else besides he's good in combat. Yep. And, uh, yeah, he also had the alert feet. And he was a pretty, like, uh... Oh. I had the Ring of Evasion, 
the animated shield, and then my vicious weapon, which was my katana. Those were my like three magic items that I got. Nice. Yeah, I I didn't. <laughs> I should have gotten better magic items. I think Maybe. because I kept myself to the dragon slayer rapier, which is just like a plus one thing with special stuff for dragons, and then an amulet like that protects you against divination and people looking into you. Mm-hmm. That's about it. I didn't think you'd be coming in here if i if i knew that i'd be like oh yeah this bunny he's got like the hand of vecna <laughs> he's got well the thing also is also the like, sword of cast <laughs> i have to hit you in order for my magic item to even be worth anything true besides that i, I just wanted to be good in combat because it was like a it was originally a one shot and we might end up fighting each other and one of us was going to be a traitor yeah i could have used some fun stuff but you know i had stuff you know like agonizing blast so i could hit you yeah it was really good uh hexblade's curse if i went in uh, you you saw it as like as players, but I don't think the characters saw me like just completely wreck a spider. <laughs> yeah, I don't think we noticed that. There were a couple of combat encounters, some puzzle encounters. It was yeah. fun. Donovan and my characters kind of partnered yeah. up. Donovan and I kind of partnered up the entire con. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. The, so the point of Ricky's game was that at the very beginning he gave us some cards, uh, and one of us would have been like the deceiver, you know, mm-hmm. the spy. The deceiver. Would have been the person at the end that like reveals themselves and, you know, gets to try to kill everybody or whatever. Mm-hmm. You know, so uh, he said, whoever gets the Joker, like, is the, uh, you know, you're the guy. You know, it's it's the one with Thanos on it. Nice. He's looking at a random picture that will probably post in a second. Uh, Did so, I send it to you? I think I only sent videos. Oh, no. Uh, you only sent videos. Oh, damn. Yeah. There might be photos. I'll have to look again. But uh, that is to say that I'm the one that actually got the Thanos card. Yes. Which meant that I legally was the deceiver. Yes. You which were helped the deceiver. Me, which did help me out. I was like, oh, sick. I picked the perfect kind of guy. Now, unbeknownst to me, AJ thought that he got the Thanos card. Yes. Which, to be fair was confusing it was it was a marvel deck if you didn't notice by thanos that ricky had gotten and on this marvel deck is hulk with like his armor his helmet on yeah and so aj thought that that was just thanos because like at a real quick glance it's not the most detailed like in the face area so you look at that and you see the giant j in the corner and since it's a style the j in the corner it's a stylized themed deck so yeah and but like like I was sitting next to him, I and he was like asking about these, like, "Hey, so like, so like, if it's if it's a J, is that the Joker?" And I, I think we told him like, "No, no, no. If it's just says if it's just a J, that means it's a Jack. It's mm-hmm. not a Joker." Yeah, but alas, it's like if it just says Joker, then, it, but, uh, but the confusion it made it cool, you know. And then Ricky's character just decided to also be a bad guy. Mm-hmm. And then I got, and then my guy got Harry, messed up. Yeah, then Harry Donovan and I tried. Yeah, Harry Donovan, you tried your best, but we were just too awesome. Yeah. Also, you had a mind flare on your side. Sure. But you guys did really good. Yeah, but then it was like... Especially when you put me at a commission. Exactly. Which was really fast. Yeah. Disappointing. But then, Ricky snubbed me because, like, his character was down, AJ's character was basically down... My guy was like the last one, one of the last ones standing at least, and I got off a suggestion on a mind on the mind flare that was there, the one mind flare that he said that there was that was there. You know, mm-hmm. I was like, sick, I can do some fun stuff with this in like an after game sort of epilogue, but no, apparently, with no clues or hints whatsoever, this was like a mind flare organization that was looking for sleeper agents to put in other dimensions. I mean, there were hints. Were there? Yes. The whole dungeon was things were out of time, concocted to, concocted together. There wasn't any hints that there was a large number of mind flares that were ready to kill us just in case we killed one of them or something. Yeah, uh, that that was yeah that that there. was probably the biggest part that took me off guard. It's like wait, but like you can't even let me have an epilogue. <laughs> I'm just like maybe I can do some fun stuff. I'm no. not trying to get all this fun stuff done immediately. You'd, uh, you uh, did you. I know you. You get, did you give in to them, or did you die with? No, them? they just killed me. Or did they put you back? Ricky in the just agent? Ricky just had his werewolf guy suddenly come out of nowhere and kill me. Like I couldn't even dodge. I had stuff no, like I, hellish rebuke I'm that could sure, deal with that. Yeah, but you would have died. Sure. I, I'm pretty sure he killed you because your character was trying to take control, and the mind flares are like, no, no. 
We're sure. The ones yeah. Who I just I remember there was like a big stitch of like a minute or two of him just telling me numbers and me asking like, wait, but what's happening? Like you're not like this is a full solid minute or two. I get like maybe something's attacking me, but like me as a player, I need some context to know like what is hitting me. Surprise, baby. I guess so. Yeah. But that's just me like being butthurt about not being able to like control a mind flare for a little while. <laughs> that's that's purely me being butthurt. But uh, it was a fun day though. It was a it was a fun. Yeah, we split a second we, day. We split uh, a die set. We did, yeah. Was, we each got one. Yep, we each got one. I think Ricky just kept two with him. Yes, you know, well, because there's only yeah, there's of only us. yeah. Uh, he kept. What did you get? I got the D8. I believe Donnie and I, he got a D10 and I got the percentile because they're essentially the same dice. Yeah, I think uh, AJ got, got the D6. We got the, the tag team merit badge, essentially. Pretty much. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you got the nice pole merit badge. AJ got the mysterious antagonist merit badge. Yeah. And then Harry got, oh, guys, it was funny. Harry played a wizard. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure you saw it in the video already, but I love that he used fake Yu-Gi-Oh cards for his spells. <laughs> Counterspell! <laughs> it was so good. It was pretty good. It was awesome. But yeah, here's the rest of that day. It's been several hours. We've been crowned. Yeah. Uh, here's mine. Yeah, let's see it. Uh, how do you think, what do you think so far? We're at the boys. The boys are at the booth, I think, still. Or they also might, because they also wanted to go up there. But yeah, so so far we just looked in there, spent more money at the beginning of LA Comic Con than we ever have before. I actually bought stuff. I bought more stuff. I bought more stuff now than I did, I think, the past two years combined. Yeah, once we get back, we got to check out all of this stuff. Oh, 100%, 100%, 100%. Yeah. I had to play. I had to play Resident Evil 4. You know how they have, like, the suitcase mechanics? I had to play that with my backpack to everything to play. I Tetris did. Tetris did. Anything you want to say to the camera? Uh, hello. I've never been on camera before. Okay, what about you? Speak your I wish for a transition. Woo! Oh, yeah! Rolling around at the speed of sound. Got places to go, gotta follow my rainbow. So this mystery box apparently has five to ten minis, uh -huh. a dice set, and I don't know what else. I forgot what she said. Drugs, maybe. How much did it cost? Twenty-five bucks. She said what? I mean, <laughs> he said drugs. If it's, if it's five to ten minis, five minis. That's pretty five good. Minis, that's, already the money. that's a lot. One of those minis. All those minis are like bushes. Well, it doesn't feel like it. <laughs> so, oh. oh, and they're colored they're too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, AJ. <laughs> oh yeah, she's a tired of mithril hall. Dungeon tiles. Oh look, sick. A dungeon tile. That's cool. This is a orc warrior. Will you take me to that booth? I'm gonna go get one of Dark Traveler. There's still more. What is this? No skeleton. Oh this is. Oh, remember your first session? No. Gargoyle. Bent sword. Kirsty fighter. There's still more in here. Another tile. They have medication for that. <laughs> this is the funny they say, guy. And they say that some of them get to come with magic cards too. That's right. Emerald Claw Soldier. Um, that sounds like a name we would yell. Carrier Emerald five, Claw! Seventh Wind. <laughs> if you count those two, you get ten, right? <laughs> a dice set. A green dice set. I got a magic card. Yo. Uh, Can I see it when you're done? It's yeah, a displacer it's based, a, isn't it? Is it a D &D set? No. Laurels of Dream Death. Legendary creature, Cat Nightmare. I thought it was a displacer beast. It looks like one, kinda. Harry, you like green, right? Oh, and these are shiny. Oh, I think this card's like busted in uh, modern group. I don't know why, but I saw those. I saw that, and I was like Donovan. Those would still be such good dice for Ben. That's what he looks like. That's actually a pretty good card. So. Is that everything? Yeah. Cool. Seven, eight minis. What's the review? What's the review, Ricky? Bro, I definitely think I get the money for it. What's Ricky's reviews? Hey, plug them. I don't remember their names. 
Awesome. And where are they at? Over there. Here, they're over there. <laughs> Let that focus. Time Top Tavern. And then AJ's going to go get some? If you do it. It's not bad. I mean, if you get the minis in it, you can play with it. Well, if let's, see, let's see what there is over there for, before you go. Yeah. Just if I can find one that's just together. All right, Donovan, say goodbye to the camera. Bye, camera. I'll miss you most of all, Scarecrow. As we pan out, the Donovan flies away. Oh, no, he didn't. He didn't commit to the bit. And now, now he's dead. <laughs> This is a target run. Dee dee doo. 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 We got dino nuggies, uh, uh, tater toddies. Uh, I got myself chicken. Then we got cereal, cookie, chip, lotion for me, soda, Gatorade, and then uh, Harry's buying a jacket. He's buying a fancy jacket. Ooh. <laughs> and ooh. Ooh. Wow. It's it's like 3D. It's almost like I'm there. Wow. <laughs> How does it feel? Not that you can feel it because obviously you can't. Oh, it's like a jacket. Yes. But it's like a, you know, like a, hmm, as opposed to a, oh. Ah. Uh, not like that. Oh? No. Hmm. Mm. 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 Uh. And we're back, guys. Day, day three, uh, December second. There's a lot of footage on this one, but yeah, I think like most of it is a certain thing that you're probably seeing already. The panel. Yeah. The so uh, the morning was the morning. I don't remember anything specific of the morning we just sort of you know went about our day and started going around doing our thing yeah, i think i played switch a little bit i think i played super mario rpg a little bit i have yeah here's us walking around yeah i was just having just to get b-roll and then i think aj aj started talking i was like oh okay <laughs> i was like let's do this uh and we had a nice interaction me him and yeah. don uh getting to the con we found our rpg all-star friends and uh, actually... you'll see you'll see a decent amount of footage oh, yeah. of. Yeah, you. Oh man, what did your footage have when you went up there? I didn't take any footage at that point because oh, I because right. I saw that you were behind me f filming. Yeah, I, I sat there the whole time. So I was like, yeah, that's probably fine. Uh, yeah, so the th so the three boys, the three men. Even though AJ, even though I also participated in the thing last year, I wasn't called up. Yeah. Those, we were with the group. Yeah, but so we were kind of spread us... out. The three of us boys got to hang out up there, and you'll check that out, and it's pretty cool. Bo, if you're listening to this, and I know you're not, we miss you. We missed you, buddy. Miss you, Bo. Okay, Bo Foster. Go find him in person. He's real, I think. That's true. We ran into him. Yeah. Several times last year. Or the year before last. Yeah. Oh, and this was still yeah. Did we, uh, us? That's the improv panel. We watched improv. Oh, that's right. Mm -hmm. I don't. I don't think I did. I think I was somewhere else at this you point. You weren't there. There's Nico, Robin, and Chopper in right there, by the way. Cool. Uh, yeah. I think here's where I was. I believe you guys might be coming in later. I don't know. Maybe, but I believe this was when I went to go see this cool panel about Johnny Bravo. Ah, uh, yes. So it was the creator of Johnny Bravo. It was Jeff Bennett, like the dude. Uh, and then it was a couple other actors that were there. One of them was like a regular background person for Johnny Bravo. So she was super fun. Uh, they talked about like the creation of it, how it all started, the general kind of first days and like how to find the real Johnny Bravo out there in the world. Mm -hmm. And just briefly talking about like, yeah, they kind of screwed us over here. <laughs> so now we just had the one season. They talked briefly about some ideas they had for season two that just never got worked out. And then they were so nice enough to give us uh, a script reading of one of those lost episodes. And it was it was really funny. <laughs> it was a very funny one. Uh, Jeff killing it every time. 
uh, the uh, the human guy from Yo Gabba Gabba. I don't know if you remember him. No, God, you, never, you can put a I face to it. Yo Gabba Gabba. That's okay. He was also there. He was a he was a side guy as well. That's cool. Yeah, that's nice. There. Is this the same day as the Hobbit panel? Or is that the next day? This would have been. I believe that's also this lost, would have. Right? Yeah, that's also that's sadly also lost. We'll get to that. Uh, Isn't that? I don't. Uh, no, this was not the the same day. No. Because we'll get to that in a second. Gotcha. <laughs> oh man. Oh, and in the future, if you're listening, please, while this conversation is going on, just put the shot of of, of the Dwayne the Rock Johnson guy. <laughs> Oh, please do. He's beautiful. <laughs> I love that. That was so fun. Yeah. And then we sort of hung out by ourselves for a little while. Everyone was sort of just we like we just took this whole day basically to just swerve around all of the aisles. Yeah, we finished to check out looking, everything that I was there. Every single vendor uh, by the second, because on the third we would be going back for final purchases. Yeah, I don't know what this is of, but did I record that? Well, have. isn't no? That's that'd be Donovan. Uh, w- oh, okay. Uh, I guess who, who is this? Who whomst is going on? What's the file name? Uh, it's oh, seven it's out of me. twenty-four. <laughs> oh, did I just record it bad one time? Sorry. Is that is that Matt Smith? Thing? Yeah, that's Matt Smith. Okay. Yeah. Donnie so, and I watched the Matt Smith panel. Yeah. So Matt Smith gets to talk for a little bit. Mm-hmm. Oh, I guess a lot of it. I recorded a beginning and an end to him. Well, that's good. I missed a lot of the middle because Donnie recorded some, but I don't think he sent it. And then Donnie and I were hanging out and uh, like literally we ate after that's the panel. Right. That lady talks about Doctor Who because she's also wearing a Matt Smith outfit. Fun fact. And then I meet up with my friend Cameron uh, who was showing up. I had a couple of other friends there uh, that I saw in passing when I was by myself. And then I actually saw them again the next day when I was with donovan yep. spoiler alert yeah so there's uh, your guy Cammy. yeah yeah so you. yeah i eventually got back around to you guys yeah, yeah as you can see i'm i'm sneaking up there. sneaking up on them as you'll see did you guys get food bit. right before then too uh yo that's a <laughs> that's a good frame to leave it on yeah well with it we haven't played any of the any of the footage yet so out of context we'll just have it have it right here uh this little this little thumbnail uh, you'll know exactly which one it is, future me. Uh, but I was having some fun stuff. It was just a lot of walking, uh, a lot of checking out some stuff, a lot of, uh, was it, um, I don't know if you, the, like you and Donovan, you were talking to this one guy who was like, oh yeah, I met Stan Lee at this one thing. or Oh yeah, I don't have any footage of that, huh? No, uh, I think you were just enraptured in the conversation. I think that might have been the last day, though. No, that or no, was it wasn't. Saturday. It was this day. Yeah, Saturday. I believe it was Saturday. It could have been possibly Friday, yeah. but yeah. So I bought, I bought, so I bought a lot of stuff. You guys will see this at the end. I do at home when I get back home. Yeah, I go over everything that I got, um, and I'll bring up the posters. Uh, but uh, where I got like the Godzilla stuff, where I bought from my dad, the guy who worked there, who was the artist, he was. Sh- I think I think he was trained by Jack Kirby, if I remember correctly. He was trained by Jack Kirby when and he was like 18 or he was like a young kid. And he just got brought into the industry, basically. And then, like, at one point, someone walks in to talk to us or a, a, an older lady was talking, like, talking for a second. And then, like, she went away. And then he looked at us and he was just like, oh, by the way, she runs, like, she's like the lead executive for like Battlestar Galactica or something like that. Like something like some sci-fi show. And then he was talking about how he and I believe his wife were part of like, uh, they did some sort of executive role on the speed racer franchise. I think maybe in the U S it was crazy. Cause he had some speed racer artwork as well. And I was like, this is nuts. And I think he's really cool. And he really liked us. And then we didn't, we didn't go back to see him. Oh no, we did go back to the booth, but he wasn't there. And it was like, well, we're leaving. Cause Donnie and I went, uh, when we were making our rounds. Yeah. I remember Sunday. me and AJ were just hanging out, waiting for you guys. We were sitting in these cool gamer chairs oh, and yeah, you were talking for like 14 minutes. It was a while. Yeah. Well, it, it was uh, a lot of, of topics. Yeah. And a I, lot of topics. And you know, I came, I came in at the end for like the last 16 minutes. It was like, 
it was a lot of talking and also in those situations not that I want to leave but it was like I don't know how to leave this conversation the way this man is going on yeah. but I he was so cool and he was so nice I'd love to run into him again that's cool his name is somewhere like in my merch I can find it pretty sure sure yeah just let me know and I'll put up a, a nice sweet picture for you I mean it's in my video where I go over everything mm-hmm. I got he got, he did yeah. the but we yeah we met up with each other over there and they were telling about some telling me about some weird anime stuff Mm-hmm. Uh, because we were all going over to this very strange panel that uh, we had read a short description of, and we were like, oh, yes, please, this is where we need to go. Yeah, luckily my friend Cameron also wanted to go to yeah. that panel. Yep. Or uh, actually, I think I convinced him. <laughs> yeah, it's... Uh, I don't think we explained it in the videos. Yeah. But basically, it's a choose-your-own-adventure, and you vote on like what one or two options and they have some people like going up to pitch what option yeah <laughs> which i think my friends could have done better <laughs> yeah uh but um it was really cool the music it was awesome um i really hope they come back again and yeah i have a lot of footage of that so if you end up seeing a lot of that as like b-roll or just stuff in the background when we're talking about this that's why i have like over 20 minutes of footage of this panel it was amazing it was amazing as you'll probably see in some of the clips that we put up, you know, as you can see, we all we all have to vote no about stuff. <laughs> like, oh my gosh, yeah, they're <laughs> they're like there was some. So for context, uh, in this choose your own adventure, there was a part that involved, hey, you're looking through this thing to like check out the ocean. Do you look up or do you look down? And then, and then it's like, if you look down, like you look to the sandwich. like you look to the left, there's like like a sandwich or something. Or you look to the right, there's something else. Do you now choose to look up or down? And then we all had to vote up or down. And we're like, but if we look down, that might be like a, a better sandwich. I just remember all of us yelling to look down for the sandwich. And then they were like, there's not really a sandwich. We're all like, oh, one can dream. But I don't think we won the vote anyways that time. I don't think so either. No, there's. Uh, yeah, we're just yeah, some good shots. scrolling through all of this. There's there's a lot of like shorter ones that I'm seeing here. Oh, I thought you would just you guys had just recorded for like seven minutes for each of these videos, but no, these are no, nice. I have like 18 seconds, 31 seconds here. Then I had 14 minutes. Yeah, we're getting through one. it here. Yeah, 42 seconds Literally for one Literally the last here. three or we're at, not. We're at 20 out of 24 videos for him. Yeah, and then four minutes for, I think this was the ending? No, that's Don the Dweeb. Oh, yeah, Don the Dweeb came up. That's four minutes, and the next one is the last one, the 14-minute one. Yeah, so for, uh, it probably won't, I'm still on the fence if we're going to, if I'm sh- going to show this, like, 14 minute stretch I don't think it's necessary. of adventure. I just made sure to get a lot of footage for you to use. I don't think it's a, a necessary either, but also, it was, was filmed horribly. Yeah, it was a very it was a very pretty ending mm-hmm. to a rather rather pretty kind of day. As we're all now kind of walking out and it's nighttime and we're getting ready cuz there was Woo. a good job Donnie. Do a Donnie roll. I saw that in Clue all the time. I saw that backwards really in Clue. Because he did like a like a backward somersault from a handstand, and then you and uh you and Donnie went into Tarjay. Yeah. Did you guys uh was there any? Or no, I think, I think this was one of those where. Uh... Oh, I'm literally we're gonna zoom in and it's you two. Oh right. Yeah no, I wanted to go in because we were getting low on ban- on banana bananas, and like one or two other things. Oh, so no. I was like, I gotta make sure I got like potassium, or I'm gonna have just a bunch of cramps, dude. Uh, and then me and uh, Ricky, of course. Yeah. Yeah, it was bananas well. and like something else, but I can't remember. I don't remember. But it was cool. And then the last video here you'll see is uh, you just kind of yeah. looking at your stuff. Oh, me here. and Donnie are drunk. Or not? We're not drunk. We're high a little. One of the two, I'm sure. We're doing a bit also. Yeah. But yeah, we're sorry if this is again. It's ramshackle, you know. So there are some of these days that it's just like that's it's a blur. Second. What most of what I saw there. Mm-hmm. But I'm telling you, it was all awesome. So here's the, the rest of that. Here's the whole of that day. Hello. Hello. No one is available. Take your call. 
Please hang on. We'll try again later. Oh, uh, beep. Uh, Hello. Uh, hi. This is uh, is your is your fridge on? Um. Cause I'm horny. Oh. Well, I guess I can tweet you in the brief. Huh? Okay. Um. That sounds good. I'll see you later. Bye. Beep. And now the rest of this will be B-roll. <laughs> if someone ever asked me if my refrigerator is running, uh -huh. I'm going to say, no, I called you guys six hours ago. <laughs> I already got it fixed. <laughs> My refrigerator doesn't run, okay? It's encumbered. It just walks. Why doesn't it run? Doesn't have the energy. Yeah. Then he prefers his fridge is fat. Uh, they prefer the term uh, th uh, richly stored. Harry, what's your biggest fear? Is it being recorded? Because, oops. Good answer. I too lay awake in the dead of night, fearing that the car will appear above my head, staring down at me. Asking, do you want to stay asleep? <laughs> do you want to stay asleep? <laughs> Zenku! I still have to pop over at one point. We uh we got a group of people here who were all at last year's one of them. Hey, welcome back! Yay! Yay. <laughs> <laughs> I guess uh, it's just go to show you people love getting wiped out in RPGs. So, happy to have you back. Excited for the opportunity to just cut you down again, so thank you so much for taking the opportunity. Hi, my name is Gordon. What's going on? I'm like, I'm going to be here. You're going to be here. I'm going to be here. I'm going to be here. Ricky lost like a little uh, so bit.
Don. Hey Don. Yes. It's The Rock. It's it's The Rock. Look, he brought another guy in front of him as a as part of his costume, but that's The Rock in cosplay. The Rock is cosplay an X-Man. That's insane. In sa- insane. And there's Owen. We're going that way.
If you see something you like, we recommend that you buy it. We got What'd you get? Okay, let's get out of the way. This is on your That thing was that thing was going. And you got your? Yeah. Yeah. Your. your favorite. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Well, you're supposed to. Do you want to keep the capsules? Or do you want to recycle it there? It doesn't matter. I was like, does that one still have a toy inside? No, it just has the paper. Spoop. In the fanny pack. I haven't had any water today. Oh, yeah. Did you get a first try? Wow, and you bought extra tokens. You know what that means? You can buy more? I get to buy you guys this for the, for the thing. Ah. Four dollars to six. Please welcome to the stage, Matt Smith. Woo! Oh, he's here. Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello. California. Hello. 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 Yeah, it's nice to be in LA, which is nice and sunny and warm. England is absolutely perishing. Yeah, so yeah. My uh, family, my dad's side of the family lives in Dundee, Scotland. Oh, it's going to be cold up there. Terrible, yeah. And I actually, I had a friend ask my aunt one time, well, when's a good time to, you know, come visit? And she goes, oh, anytime. The weather's always terrible. Yeah, pretty much in Dundee. Pretty much. But, you know, we, we rolled out the sunshine uh, just for you, so Thank you're welcome. <laughs> Much appreciated. Uh, so, Matt, uh, season two for uh, House of Dragon trailer drops today. Yes. I haven't actually seen it yet. So. What fortuitous timing. You haven't seen it though. No, oh, no, yeah. no. I've, um, You've been so, a bit busy today. Yeah, so um, I'm looking forward to it. I mean, have you seen it? Is it, is it, is it, is it good? What do you think, audience? Good? It's oh, really good. Very good, yeah. No, the the outfits exciting. are looking fabulous this season, I must yeah. say. Yeah. I feel like yeah. they're stepping up the fashion game. Uh, but well, I wanted to like ask you, to so do you have an ear for languages? Because you have a lot of lines in High Valyrian. Was that complicated for you to learn, or was that quite easy? Yeah, it is quite a complicated. Yeah. Season 2, summer 2024. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, all right, I have one, one last question. Um, okay, yes, right here. Yes, you. Hello. I was wondering, did being on strike this summer and kind of away from the industry give you an opportunity to introspect on your career thus far? And if so, what are you looking for in projects now? Well, I don't know if you're aware, yeah. <laughs> but House of the Dragon didn't actually go on strike. It was one of the few. It was one of the few. It's a very complicated <laughs> unionized story, which I won't get into. So it did give me cause for introspection for a million different reasons, because and they were, it was all very conflicting. But I won't get into that. Um, and what? And the second part of the question was, 
what is what do I want to do next? Essentially, what is it? I don't know really. Um, I'm about to play next, so I guess that's what I want to do because that's what I'm going to go and do, and I'm, so I'm going to do that in London. If any of you find yourself in London, <laughs> please come and see head on me. down to the West End. Um, yeah, and then uh, after that, you know, I'm going to do something else, and <laughs> in the meantime, I'm going to walk my dog. What's your dog's name? Bobby. Bobby? Bobby. Oh, what kind of dog? Yeah. I really want the doctor to have a dog that isn't a robot that dog, is a is an actual dog. Yeah. Or even just get canine back. Yeah. yeah. What, is, what does canine look like in 2023, Oh, you've got to keep him original. You, I know. You, you can't upgrade him. We like, can't yeah. give him a Tesla makeover. No, he's got to be like, yeah. canine. Yeah, ultimate. that's part of the charm of yeah, a doctor yeah. who is being able to see the seams a little bit. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yes, exactly. That's, that's, that's what it's all about, really. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, I think that is all the time that we have. Thank you for coming have. Yes, thank you all so much all for right. coming. And you're, thank you're still doing signings and photos. Yeah, I'm going back to so, table now, uh, so. so hopefully some of you have already had a chance to swing by and otherwise, uh, yeah. yeah. So thanks, guys. Thank you all for being nice here. Thank you. Thanks very much. Yeah, Daddy's gone. <laughs> So Donovan, tell me about uh, day. Uh, first of all, how was day one at Comic Con? Day one was a ton of fun. Um, met some cool people. Had some neat little interactions. Just a vibe, you know. And cool then, people, neat interactions, a vibe, you know. Yeah. Uh, and what was your favorite part about today so far? Um, favorite part of today was seeing the Matt Smith booth because that was incredible. It was awesome seeing somebody who like literally. Um, for most of my memory, like, has just been such an important part of my life. Um, it's, it's weird to say that, but it really is true. Um, you know, Doctor Who was, that was my childhood, man. Like, from age 12 to about, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. We were at the Matt Smith, uh, did you read the Matt Smith thing earlier? Of course it was. Hell yeah. No, 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 I made sure I, I, made sure I yes, avoided it. Clear of that. <laughs> I did not want to be there. I usually go to cons, but the minute I saw that Matt Smith was going to be here, I literally was like, mm -hmm. entire fetching cons. Because I made sure I got my ticket, the autograph, and the photo op. It took all of my self-control to not do the autograph and the photo op, because I was like, if it was David Tennant, I would have done it in a heartbeat. David Tennant's my dog here, through and through. But like Matt Smith, it it was so tempting. It was everything I had not to. I, that would probably be a little bit reversal, uh, uh, reversal for me because, like, David Tennant, yes, he's the one that made me fall in love with the Doctor. Like, the Ninth Doctor was cool and all. I really did like it. But David Tennant made me absolutely fall head over heels. But I connected more with the Eleventh Doctor. I connected I, uh, that. Just, I especially love when he was like, like, I'm still not ginger. <laughs> this is not a box job. So with the fact that he said I'm still not ginger, I'm like, he wanted to be a redhead. Like, yes. <laughs> but, yeah, I just... I connected more with him and all the So, uh, I ran into a friend of mine here because he's chilling. His name is Cammy. That's Cammy. Um, but most of the pick of what he did, like the whole panel, what he did, like the whole panel. Three, two, one, Nani. What's this? This is basically a choose your own adventure for the whole audience and it's going to be video game music in the background. I'm not going to have to get up and... And this is just Final Fantasy. Da 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 da
Yay. I hope that it caught well. Woo! Wait. That means when I was doing this, it was recording the other way. Yeah, now it's Chemical Plant Act 1. Look at that. It says, I'm in. You're right. Powder. And you have this incredibly hard challenge when you play this Nintendo Switch. And what book you have in your hand is strategy. Boo! Screw strategy guides. Let's get drunk. <laughs> All right, come That's here. Exactly. You've heard from two champions. Now it is time to open the voting. You remove your hat and place it. That was A. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> The it's on the top. No. You remove your jacket. <laughs> that was the A button. Here is the X button. Boom. You proceed to get Here we go. Roy drunk on those tiny. That's why. <laughs> Oh, man, <laughs> oh, I see what's happening here. And pull out the game out. By the people are being overruled. You proceed to get rip roaring drunk. Yes! Before the seventh Bloody Mary takes effect. Seven? Holy shit! Such a good idea. As the point takes off, you stare out the window and begin to hallucinate. Oh, hell yeah! Yeah. Promptly and takes you to the local museum. Fuck yeah, it does. The driver seems surprised by your choice. I've never taken anyone from the airport straight to the museum, he says. Most people can't wait to get into the water. I guess I'm not most people, you reply with an awkward wink and a giggle, ending in a snort. Feeling especially cool, you equip your notepad and spectacles as you exit the Uber and enter the totally rad museum of natural history. Yeah! Ooh, Secret of Evermore. Ooh. Highlight on Donovan. Kill it. He killed the beat. <laughs> or did the beat kill him? At least for one day. But gosh diddly darn. <laughs> love yourself a good museum. Gosh diddly darn. As you walk in the direction of your hotel, you pass some docks with a scenic view of the ocean. And as with every dock in a tourist area, there's a chintzy looking telescope you can look through for 25 cents. Let's do it. Of course, you're a sucker for chintzy. So you quickly find yourself 25 cents poorer. You are looking out at the sea through the telescope. You have limited time before your quarter runs out. Press right to look right. Press left to, well, you get it. Uh, time is almost whoops. finished. To look up, press down to eat a spaghetti sandwich. Yo, down, 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 down. down. Down! Down! Hi, I'm Dom the Dweeb. I mean, uh, Dweeb. Um, and, uh... Alright, he now, sucked. Yeah, he's right, terrible. Alright, get him out of here. Now. If, as the previous patron said, we've got to follow our dreams. And what if we dream of tasting spaghetti between two slices of bread? Yeah! La cucina d'Italia! Johnny, Johnny Eureses! 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 Yeah, man. I don't think I don't think you convinced him, but I think it was a good try. <laughs> Do the seagulls get to vote? Wow! <laughs> wow. How unexpected! Whoa! What's this? Rats. Time's up, and that was your last coin too. Oh, no. 
Oh well, it's starting to get late anyhow. Wait. You make your way to the hotel. There was no sandwich. No sandwich? As you walk around and go to the courtyard Mario Art Hotel, you happen upon the most beautiful fountain you've ever seen. This feels like that perfect storybook moment for you to make a wish. You reach out oh. your pocket for a quarter and... Oh, this is good that we had the coin. Grant, you already spent your last quarter on that sick oh, telescope. Shit. You really want to make a wish, though. You rifle through your inventory ha. for something reasonably coin-shaped. <laughs> but the only thing you're willing to part with is... Uh, I was going to say, what is that? Your <laughs> pants. Hey, yo! The fairy appears, uh -oh. looking at you expectantly. Oh, boy. At any rate, you make a secret wish, then offer your undergarments <laughs> to the fountain. Oh, fuck yeah, dude. I don't have You reach into your inventory and grab your blue dancing shoes, equipping them on your feet. We still don't have pants on. Within seconds, you hear a chorus of gasps, and the line begins to part. Even the intimidating bouncer seems impressed. <laughs> he ushers you into the nightclub without delay. Have fun. Insulted and enraged, 
the creeper engages you in combat. Yo! Somehow, none of these trucks 